Former Premier Hao Bo Chun and a group of former national security officials visit Taiping Island on May 5th. They took a military aircraft to the island. Reports say two U.S. F-18 Hornet combat jets accompanied the aircraft part way. A Democratic Progressive Party lawmaker condemned the trip, saying the U.S. sent the jets to put pressure on Taiwan. A Kuomintang lawmaker said Taiping Island is a part of Taiwan and it doesn't matter what the U.S. thinks. The defense ministry said it cannot reveal details, but the two jets did not pose a risk to the group's aircraft. On the 5th, a 30-member delegation led by former Premier Hao Bochun flew to Taiping Island to assert the Republic of China's sovereignty in the South China Sea. According to reports, the group encountered two U.S. F-18 combat jets on its return flight. The two jets were reportedly within sight of Taiwan's aircraft for several minutes before flying off. A Democratic Progressive Party legislator says the group escalated tensions in the South China Sea and the U.S. sent the jets to pressure Taiwan. In response, a Kuomintang lawmaker said Taiping Island belongs to Taiwan and Taiwan should not be concerned about the U.S. response. International military expert and former legislator Ling Yufang says the two F-18s were following standard operating procedure and left the area without provocation after confirming the aircraft belonged to the ROC military. The Ministry of National Defense, meanwhile, said it was not at liberty to discuss details, but the U.S. did not violate any international laws or threaten Taiwan's aircraft in any way.